A couple weeks ago, Chipotle had a special where you could get a free year of Chipotle. All you had to do was get top five on the leaderboard. The winners would be chosen every day at midnight. Now, I was determined to get those burritos. First problem arises, however, because I didn't even know there was this wonderful promotion until April 12th, which was five days into the promotion. That meant I only had two days to try and get on the burrito leaderboard. Second, I'm still in school. That limits me even more. That means I can only get on at certain times to start my burrito rolling. But if the chance is there, I'm gonna take it. So on April 12th at 6 p.m., about six hours before midnight struck, I started up my stream and started my journey to roll as many burritos as possible. I do have a little goal slide right here. Goal. Get 4,000 burritos rolled. Lord help me. And oh boy will I try, oh boy. Taking a look at the leaderboard, I predicted that if I was able to roll 4,000 burritos, then that would give me a considerable lead over all my competitors. Little did I know. I also got some music. Oh. Really feel like a boss battle right now. And so I started my burrito rolling journey. I was in it for the long run. Because I didn't do math before starting, I had little idea how long it would take for me to get to 4,000 burritos. But spoiler alert, it takes a while. Mmm. Pelo, some cheese, and guac. Easy. Another thing to keep in mind is during the first 30 burritos, the speed increases every 5 burritos until it stops. So Blanco, mild salsa, bam. 15 to 100, baby. If I get to 500, I'm on the leaderboard. But the th those top people, they're insane! They did like 3,000, alright? So I was like, hmm, how do I get on this leaderboard? I did some calculations right on my calculator. I was like, how long is it going to take for me to get this burrito? It was like saying, 11 hours! I was like, 11 hours? I'm just gonna assume it's not 11 hours because I'm already at 97. This guy's sauce. 100 burritos! Fajitas. Medium salsa, hot salsa, bam. Why would you want medium salsa and hot salsa on the same burrito? You just choose one of them. I am the judgmental cashier. Every order that you make, I am judging you for. I am judging you for every decision that the- You want more brown? Okay, you can have some more, I guess. I'd rather you didn't, though. Maybe I could understand maybe like medium salsa and- Mild salsa and medium salsa. Because it is different colors. No! This can't be! Easy! Oh, crap. That was really close. That was one of my closest calls, and it would not be the last. Okay, so, cheese. 200, baby! 200 burritos! Almost 110. This, this, this one is 110th. Okay, so guac. There we go. 110 burritos. That is not close at all. But it's close in my heart. It's not close. It's still not close. It's it's not close at all. Bro, you're gonna eat <laughs> You're gonna eat just Chipotle? Exactly. It's free, right? If every I'll just have it everything's just gonna be free. And that's how I'll survive. At this point you should just work at Chipotle. Exactly. I could have- I could have just worked at Chipotle with how good I am. Hey Chipotle, you should hire me. All my concentration, every brain cell right now, thinking about Chipotle and how much I could roll these burritos. What's the crock order for Chipotle? I'm just gonna be completely honest, I have never went to Chipotle in my goddamn life. I, I've never went to Chipotle, so I wouldn't actually know. Imagine you did all that work for nothing and you don't even get Chipotle. I'll cry. That's what's gonna happen. I will cry tears of- Sadness. I just found out food poisoning is super co common in Chipotle, so have fun. I, I watched like this one, there was like this animated, I think it was the odd ones out, right? And he was talking about how there was like, there was like cockroaches in his Chipotle. I looked it up, this is fake news, but uh oh. What do you think you'll order when you finally win the free year of Chipotle? What do I think I'll order? I don't freaking know. I would. Probably want beans. I like bean burritos and probably some guac. Do I even get guac with it? I like guac. 499. So close. Two. 
500. Did you know that there's only 20 other people that are der as deranged as I am? I thought that's an interesting fact. If, if I were to crash now, that that would be bad. I would legitimately be like, ugh. And then, uh, I'll try again tomorrow. <laughs> the t chat gets really delayed on YouTube. If I were to stream on Twitch, though, uh, it would be a lot less delayed. If you would like to join my Twitch, go to twitch.tv slash crockscore. But also just subscribe, because I stream here on YouTube as well. This game- this is the game that crashed for like two- Oh that- yeah this was- what, The game that crashed Roblox for two days in October. No, I don't think that was actually true. That was like- I definitely remember the whole October drama or whatever. And like, oh, Chipotle crashed Roblox for t But this is actually a different one. This is a new Chipotle experience. And I basically, I saw it on TikTok uh, from someone that you could have gotten free Chipotle, but I didn't get free Chipotle. But then I saw that there was another option. If you play this game and you get top five on the leaderboard, then you get free Chipotle for a year. Do you possible accept fan art? I. I'm trying to, alright? I've been trying to make a Discord server, and, uh, I'm kind of lazy. When I- when that comes out, then I would accept- be able to accept fan art. Hey, luckily now I have a Discord server, so go into the description and join my Discord server. Also, look at this fan art they actually posted. It's actually kind of swag. Thanks a lot. Oh, by the way, we just- we just hit, uh, 800 burritos. Can't wait until the Discord is out. Probably gonna submit a ton of fan art? Pog? No way. No way! There's no way. No! Oh no! No way! Two hours and 30 minutes in the stream, I flunked at 804 burritos rolled, which didn't even get me on the leaderboard anymore. So, was that it? Does that mean I will not get my burritos? I knew I wouldn't give up. I couldn't. I was currently experiencing the sunk cost fallacy in real time. So I ended the stream with a promise that I would continue the next day. I only had one day left and one more try to get this year of burritos, and I am not a quitter. After ending stream, I went to sleep. When I awoke, I found this comment on the live stream. I won fifth place in yesterday's competition. I made a script that runs in the background whilst I'm away. You could very well say that as exploiters botted my way to the top five as it's practically impossible to get a high score in this game just by brute force. You know what? I'm okay with this. I'm sure it's still possible to do it by hand. So I of course asked what their final score was. Mine was 5,771. 5,771? 5,771? Let's do the math! Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna start the stream tomorrow. Right when I get off school and roll burritos that way. And just hope that that will be enough. So it is time. It is time for some burrito, epic burrito rolling. Now, this, the, the leaderboard has gotten considerably worse. Like, this isn't funny now. You see this? Top five? And it's 10,000 burritos. Last time my goal was 4,000 burritos. And last- and yesterday, it actually ended off at like 7,000 burritos? So somehow I'm going to have to beat that. So here is the new goal for today. Bam. Get 10,000 burritos rolled. Is that even possible? Maybe. It's time for some burrito rolling. I'm gonna get this free year of Chipotle. Alright, it's time. Get ready. <laughs> okay, so Blanco and Medium Salsa. I'm already at 101. Not bad. I'm just wondering how long this will take. All day, baby. This is taking all day. This is going to be an all day project. Do you know that there are some people on the leaderboard right now? They have 8,000 rolled burritos. How did they get to 8,000 rolled burritos? So if I were to go on the same pace as I've been going, that's like. I don't know. Oh my- Yeah, someone do the math. Did the math, sorry, it will take- Uh- Oh. No, that's- It's not true! I must speed up then. This is the only way. I was going at a leisurely pace, but now it is time for my true gamer. Hey, I did some time, you can do one burrito every nine seconds. It only takes 17 hours? That's even better. Oh yes, 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 yes. For 18 hours non-stop. 
you may get some cramp. You're gonna get some or many cramps, dude. Your body will shut down. I have food and water. You know, there's the guy who like who like uh st st stayed awake for I don't know like seven days. That's gonna be me. I'll re I'll like like maybe like throughout the middle I'll like reposition myself a little bit so that I don't get that many cramps. Here's what I'll do. I'll actually like move my wrist around. Uh after every burrito so that I have at le least a little bit of a stretch. The amount of determination is amazing. Yes! I am very determined. I'm like Frisk from Undertale in the underground. The intense music just adds so much stress. I like to listen to music as if I'm fighting a boss. So right now the boss that I'm fighting is Chipotle Burrito Folding Simulator. Then it, then it. Oh my god. Oh! 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 I come back from the dead, baby. There's no more close calls, Ark. You have an unlimited supply. Yeah, I don't have to restock at all. No restocking here. If only the world looked, worked like that. But is it? What if Chipotle is just the secret to having unlimited food and Chipotle has been keeping this away from the public? Yeah, we could solve world hunger, but we refuse to. How dare you, Chipotle. But still, can I have- can I have the burritos? Yo, Chipotle, need a lifeless dude to work for ya? Got the Roblox player. Exactly, Chipotle. This is my- this is my official resume. Here's what I'm gonna do when I go up to Chipotle and I'm like, I want to get a job at Chipotle. My whole interview is just gonna be a link to this live stream. Do you think your goal is possible? There's a very slim chance and I'm taking it. But I'm gonna say this now, if I scuff up at any point, it's probably impossible at that point. What's the ideal burrito? All right, I'll, I'll tell you what the ideal burrito is. So I get some Herdez salsa and then I put uh, avocado in it. Mix, mash that up together. You get some lettuce on that. We got the beans, of course. Sour cream, fajita, cheese, all that good stuff. Very close to 600. Very- okay. By very close, I mean one away. Basically at my fingertips. Yep! 600! 799! One more! One more! It's over. It's not over. When I say it's over, I mean it's the beginning. Thankfully there's more people to live than there was yesterday. Yeah! A lot more people talking today, probably because I'm doing it at a reasonable time instead of an unreasonable time. You think I say corn? Wait. No way. No way. This can't. Ugh. Oh. Yep, I basically flunked at around the same burrito count, and by that point, there was no way I could possibly get on the leaderboard. 888, not even on the leaderboard. You see these deranged people? Look at that! 10,000! But don't think this is over. It's far from. If there's ever another burrito promotion like this again, you better bet I will be there. Even if it's against a bunch of robots, I will be the John Henry of this tale. But today is not the day.